when I when I start a stream, I'm like, hey, let me throw in a little uh little image of Paco at the start. Cut that out of uh out of the YouTube version, and you know we get some time for everyone to trickle in. But we've got some some extra time because uh, we 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 got a couple we got a couple months in game extra. We got to finish year four and year five. So don't mind me as I send out the tweet now, and people will file in. As time passes, and we earn some money by waiting. And then we can get going into this here shortly. Look, we already have some money. Where are we in October of year four? October 12th. All right, so we're halfway through October to start this off. A lot of people want to reproduce but can't find a mate. I can't exactly do a whole lot about that. Um... This is the goblin shark area or whatever. Alright. We're just gonna... Have a nice little short, uh, little sit down. <laughs> Goodness. I am going to mute the mic for a second, though. Clear my nose out. Ah, okay, sorry about that. I kind of passed out a bit uh, a little less than two hours ago or so. And, uh, <laughs> my body is not happy about me waking up immediately going like, oh shit, I gotta go stream. Do you think this bar up here slowly fills up with green the more money I have and I've just never had enough money? So basically what we're doing is we're sitting around... Uh, the, this stream is going to be the last third, no, the last fourth of year four and then year five. We, we're going to gather money. We're going to try and stay out of debt. We're going to get the sharks for the, the diver, Steph, Steph, Stephanie Balin. Stephane Balin. Uh, she wants a goblin shark and a scalloped hammerhead shark. And then we're going to feed her to the reef. And that's how this is going to work.
I guess I could have won the raffle. I didn't realize that. Scalloped hammerhead shark. Wait, is that different than a... I thought he was out of the thing for a minute there. That concerned me a sizable bit. All right. Is he is he trying trying to break his way out? We're just we're just waiting for the money to go up. I don't really know what I can do to get more money. We kind of accepted a very expensive challenge. Uh without necessarily having the funds ready for it. As I my phone is blowing up for some reason, I would like to make sure everything is okay. Everything appears to be doing just fine. Trainers need a tank entrance to train trainer Barnhill. What? Why does he... He, why do they need to train him? Um. Oh, okay. I don't believe I understand what the issue here is. But if you just want a tank entrance, here you go. You can have that one there, and we'll move this over here. I mean, hopefully that solves the problem. Not really sure what the problem is to begin with, other than, you know, no one can find donation boxes. I, I, I wonder where they could be. <clears throat> Who knows? I could also buy the improved seating at some point. I really think, being at five stars, that having improved seating for the shows is unnecessary. Um, if I could charge them extra for the improved seating, is it just me or does water look very dirty? I, hopefully that's just me. If I could charge, like, an extra money for the improved seating, then, uh, hell yeah, brother, I would jump right into that. Blue Buck 23 is not contained. I really wish I could figure out why they're doing that. Oh, good. More pregnant super velociraptors. Just what I needed. I think the, the smart money is to at least have 5000 at the end of the month to try and stay out of uh, debt. It may be more. We're going to find out here in a bit when October ends exactly how much money we lose from, uh, you know, debt and whatnot. What is my... Uh-oh. Uh where are my Galapagos turtles? Are you the Gala You're not the Galapagos turtles. You're the Galapagos turtles. 15, 16, 6, uh, see ya. All right, the rest of them are happy. Uh-oh, we're losing, we're losing a little bit of joy. Don't really know why. We are expensive, so I can't really do much else there. Do I just make all of these expensive yet? I think we do. I think we're at the point that everything should be expensive. And I feel like I may have tried this already, but we're kind of like, you know, just do it anyway. I need the money. I need a significant amount of money. So we're going to be here at about like 20,000 before too long. Why don't, wait, oh, Narwhal 3, so like their kid, okay. 19,500, we're, we're going we're gonna to hit soon. We're going to hit something soon, we're going to hit all those taxes. Can y'all hear that helicopter going overhead? Loud boy flying by. Come on, I just want to wear 19. 
They're having so many fucking babies. It's unreal. Okay. Oh my god. The debt is $10,000. You're old. See you later. Are they still upset? We gotta get rid of one of the babies. These babies gotta... One of these babies gotta go. Alright, cool. Guests love your zoo. Awesome. The fact that... The taxes are like ten thousand dollars at this point. Is a little a little out of control. I don't really know what else I could do to gain more money at this point. All of these things are still expensive. Do you cost money? Dude, you cost all the money now. Hey, Muskox 3 is given birth. Look at all that. I wish I knew it dragged me down to four and a half stars. Because it did that before I raised the prices on... Wholesome content. I miss Joey Styles. Wasn't there a, like a regular picture booth I had at one point? Does no one ever go look at the Tapirs? I mean, I guess not. There are buildings over here covering them up. It's like, we, why would you go see them? Narwhal 1 is now pregnant. Dude, let's get all of these Narwhal babies. Just rake in the cash. I'm about to start charging for the bathroom if I could. Oh no, smelly exhibit. Thank God I have employees to deal with that. I don't remember what animals we said we wanted to keep last time. I know goblin shark we need. We need to get the hammerhead. We can reroll the bangle tiger. Reroll the peafowl. Reroll the muskox. I feel like we should just keep re-rolling these three. That's what we're doing here. Nobody, nobody wants to acknowledge what happens in the reef. But we can't run away from it forever. Why is my phone blowing up? Please. Have mercy. What's the, uh, so we're looking for, what is it, a scalloped, scalloped hammerhead shark. What was that about? Trainer masters can figure it out. But do they actually need more water? I guess they do actually need more water. Area. Okay. Which one of you has the least training? Who, okay, which one is not a show? Beluga 9? Is that... Yeah, Beluga 9 is not on a show. Is Beluga 9 the only one not on a show? Wowzers. That's... That's crazy. Where's Beluga 9 at? Wait. Wait, where's Beluga 9? There they are. Oh, see ya. There's still, there's so many of them. What show are you all on? That's the money. That's the money. Beluga 7 isn't in anything. Well, see you then. Catch you later. Gotta keep them happy. Did I miss Ricky Business coming for our taxes? Bruh, it's $10,000 a month, the taxes. I think we might actually be at a stalemate. Like, if there's one thing that's going to end this series more than anything else, it's the fact that we might be at a stalemate. Bulgaria 9 is the second best Bulgaria. Because I don't know how I'm going to buy this goblin shark when we've made almost $4,000 in 11 days and every 30 days we lose $10,000. It's actually like... I was at... 20,000, the month rolled over to November, and I went to 10,000. I'm dead serious. 
I wish, like, you could get a better look at, like, the expense reports. How the fuck did Ricky Business raise it up that much? I actually have no idea. I guess I should look. There, there's gotta be a way to check, right? Zoo quick stats. Money. What's his money gained, I think? Yeah, it's... Let's, let's look at our expensive. I guess that's, like... That's a good way to take it up. So this is, like, in general, I guess. Incomes and expenses. This is what we need to look at. Where are we in the red at for October? Yeah, look at this. Dude, the staff costs us so much. The staff costs us, like, $6,000. So, monthly, we're paying about... Ignoring this, because this is, like... Ex we have to do these two. Like, I mean, this one's extenuating circumstances. Animal upkeep, it has to happen. It's it's 10000 a month for staff and upkeep. But, like, we need our staff, don't we? Where's the, where's the employee records? Look at that. There's not much we can do. Should have gotten robotic staff. I wish. We don't even have Jeeps or anything yet. I don't want the donation summary. How much money am I making for each of these? Dude, look at that. Everyone loves that's the money. That really is the money. What's our biggest money maker? It's one of these at 24,000, I think. Oh, it's it's the Storacosaurs? No, it's the uh it's the Blue Bucks. The Blue Bucks are our biggest money maker. Where are my employee records? Dunks is eating, by the way. Is there like profits, donations? Is there not just like a record of quick stats? Guest information, staff information. They're both waiting for a job. See, everyone's like doing something is the thing. They're all important. The paleontologists are not as important. I think we cut one paleontologist. Do we cut Johnson or Tr I like Trinary. We gotta we gotta get rid of Johnson. Hey, wait, actually, let's look in their thought minds. Let's see. Alright. I love digging in the dirt. Finding fossils is the best part of the job. Trinary. I like I like uh, I like Johnson's enthusiasm more. I'm sorry, Trinary, but we gotta we gotta do some layoffs here. The blue bucks the moneymaker and also the most neglected animal here. They're not really the most neglected. I just don't pay attention to them as much. Why is... What are the four red arrows? What is this? Based by assignments. Why do you have four red arrows? I think we need to cut one of the entertainers. I love my job. Kim Karen looks bored. I'm glad that Kim Karen likes my antics. Good thing there's a splash fountain here. The suit gets hot. I need to resupply. Looks bored. I better entertain. Okay, so he's going off to entertain. What's the cat doing? Leaving. Oh, he was on the stage. Ah, they're both good. One of them works the stage and the other, like, goes around and helps people. I mean, they both go around and help people, but it's, it's good to have an alternating one. Look, he's breakdancing on the stage. Spoken like a true abuser. They, they just don't cause issues. If they need something, they're going to get it. Because they just they just do everything right. Dude, the tapirs are the most neglected. Look at these things. I put the restaurant in front of them. These are the most neglected. Biome is not suitable. Well, he probably shouldn't be on the loose. That's probably issue number one. I think that's... Dude, the Blue Bucks are the number one money makers because they keep breaking out and everyone just, like, gives them money hoping they leave them alone. They're, like, trying to bribe the Blue Bucks to stay in their pin. We keep going from four and a half to five. I don't know where else I could cut more money. It's just... I just don't know.
I mean, yeah, let's sell this from, like, the Velociraptors over. I wish I could sell animals so badly. Guests can't find donation boxes. I'm fucking going gorilla. Put more down, then. That's, that's the thing, right? This looks trashy, but, like, the moment they're like, we wish we had more. You're getting more. I need the money. I can't, I can't afford... To be like, oh, it doesn't look good to have 17 donation boxes down. It's not about looks anymore. It's about profits, okay? Just cover the whole wall. Literally, just cover the wall with them at this point. Look at that. Probably the lawsuit from Peter Pirate hitting us hard. What lawsuit? There is no lawsuit. No one knows what happened to Pirate Parker. That's the money is starting soon. It's November 22nd. We're gonna, like, get to 20,000. Oh, yeah, I needed to look up, uh... I'm just gonna click on a random animal. I'm not actually gonna do anything with it. I just wanna go to the book. I, I'm not looking for a hammerhead shark. It's specifically a scalloped hammerhead shark. I need to make sure that's not locked. That's not an option. Wait, no, shark. Hammerhead. Okay, no. Maybe? To unlock the scalloped hammerhead shark in challenger campaign modes, you must earn a three and a half star zoo fame rating. All right, well, never mind then. It is, it is unlocked, so... Are you okay, Dunks? Holy shit. You made a loud fucking gag noise. That water looks green? That's what I was thinking. All the park told the police is he took a dip and never came back. No, nah, no one saw him get in the reef. No one's allowed back. Don't put the hippo in the turtle tank. That was almost real bad. Which of these were we keeping? Because I'm about to just start re-rolling a ton. You need to have at least five fame stars to unlock this slot. I see. But, but also, do you see... Good night, Super Velociraptor Prince. Uh, so, I know we're keeping Giant Ground Sloth. We're keeping Goblin Shark because we need it. And we're keeping the False Killer Whale. Reroll all of them. Even the False Idol. Even giant ground sloth. We definitely can't reroll goblin shark. Like, we need goblin shark. That's actually part of the quest. But if we're at the point of, like, we just need to do whatever we can to find this hammerhead shark, I'll reroll everything but the goblin shark. I'm gonna, it's gonna pain me. But if, if that's what we gotta do, are we at that point? I'm not putting the goblin shark down yet because we're about to have to pay our taxes. And I don't want to go into debt. Can't get rid of the false whale. So we're keeping false whale. We're keeping goblin shark. I love the koala, but we're re-rolling it. Are we keeping giant ground sloth? We, we, have, to, we have to make these decisions now. As, as I begin re -roll. What the fuck is this? Oh, it's, an, it's just a manatee. Okay. Reroll all but Goblin and the False Prophet. That's such a... Oh, I love Ankylosauruses, though. Dude, this hurts me. Alright, we're rerolling everything. Goodbye, Giant Ground Sloth. Until we get this Hammerhead Shark we're looking for. Goodbye, Komodo Dragon. He's back. No, my, my extra rolls, I needed them. I wish I could, like, get them closer, though. I'm, like, losing track of which is which. There's so many animals. I wish there was a way for me to just pay extra to buy the one I need. I think we're going to be able to get the goblin shark soon. Uh, after we, we pay our money here. 
Guests love your zoo. Well, if they could go ahead and give me a five-star rating on Yelp, that'd be greatly appreciated. Oh, no, that's a bottomless dolphin. My extra slots, I need them, so... What the fuck is this, a mandrill? I thought that was a monkey. Maybe that was the monkey. It's horrifying. Oh, look. there's our, our taxes just went down. The dragon can stay this time if he wants to be in the park so badly. Well, we're on a delay, so I've already re-rolled him. We're, we're, we're actually getting back a lot of them. It's We're really just having trouble finding the one I need. That's the issue here. Is getting the extremely specific... Dodicarus. I think I actually have the fossil for that thing. What is this? Oh, that's just Komodo Dragon. The shadow looked weird to me. Please, God. Give me the hammerhead shark. At least when we get to 20,000. I know we can put the goblin shark down. Is this a blood... Oh, it's a cave. I thought it was like a blood tiger or something. There's just so much. And none of it's what I need. I'm like, I really just want to... No, Beluga 1! The centerpiece of That's the Money. Good night, sweet prince. We're gonna... We're not, we're not gonna kick it out of the zoo. It's, it's earned its place... To pass away at home with its family. We're not going to force it out like we did before. Oh look! A panda! I know uh, some people have been wanting some pandas since literally the start of this game. Do you think we'll ever get the hammerhead shark? Look a random fucking penguin. I want some flamingos after all the nonsense goblin come back, panda. Uh, I accidentally moved towards the bottom of the screen. We'll keep the panda. I wish we could get, like, an ocean panda. And uh, fucking put it in the reef, and then it would kill people. Is this, a, like, a the world's largest known alligator? Consider the, the following... What if we used our fossils to make the giant alligator and we put it in the coral reef? No, my extra slots that I needed. I desperately needed those. Short-faced bear. At least I know that, like... Like, we're getting stuff we haven't seen before. So I don't know if there's, like, a rarity to these animals where it's, like, my heart. Where it's, like, we're just unlucky that we keep rolling ones we don't need. All right, let me rephrase. I don't know if we're, if we're exclusively unlucky or if there's a rarity to animals. So it's, like, you're, it's very unlikely that you ever get the hammerhead. Holy shit, we can get the goblin shark now. Hallelujah. I think we've already given it everything it needs. What does it eat? I mean, it eats fish, obviously. No, I want to buy the goblin shark. Goodbye, Blue Black 18. Kachank. Uh, we gotta put road down. I wish I had literally any idea which road this was. Is it this one? Dude, in my suffering. What fucking road is this? Is this brick? Yeah, it is. Oh, 
Oh, good, the Blue Bucks given birth. <laughs> Don't worry, the Blue Bucks reincarnate themselves immediately. How are you doing? I mean, you seem very happy, Mr. Goblin Shark. I don't know where Stefane Belaine is, but, uh, she'll get here eventually. Or Stefane Belaine, the, the fucking gnome. I don't remember. It's my pirate donation box. I need it. Donate! Alright. We're probably gonna go into debt. I don't know if we're gonna get 10,000, though. Why are you hungry? No, he's got food. Alright, he just complains sometimes. That's just all it is. No! Hog fist! We literally only have one left, I think. The giant warthogs were such a failure. They were such a waste of money. Their lifespan is like nothing. That was so bad. That was such a waste. All right, let's let's get back to rerolling. There, we've done it. My heart. How expensive are you? Did I almost want to buy another tapir just to fucking put them in there? Holy shit. Where's Stefane Belaine? Is that is that you? No, you're Lorraine Fine. Fucking FBI agent with a deep dark past. It's my zoo quick stats. I'd like to search uh, guests. And we're looking for Stefane Lorraine. No, Stefane Belaine. That's what I'm looking for here. Wish you could sort by is a main character. Thomas R. Jr. Niswanger. Why is the junior in the middle of his name? Shu Pranash. Jimmy Desa. Robert L. Jr. Harris. What the fuck? Jamie Mail. Stefan Belaine. I'm giving the zoo a donation as a guy. It is the gnome. The hog was so hype and did nothing. At least the blue bucks don't complain when they die. It's because they get immediately reincarnated. Watching the antics of Chester to the saber tooth. Dude, those are some sweet antics. Alright. How much does the hammerhead shark cost? 15,000. <laughs> if I just... <laughs> what if I just fucking did it right there in front of him? So, like, if I move him, is he gonna get super pissed? Is he gonna be like, Why did you move me? Ah, but, like, I don't think he can leave the park, can he? Favorite animal. Przewalski's wild horse. What? He only has $74 on him? And all he's bought are hats? Watching Educator Steen is very educational. I hate Stefan Belaine and this is Pirate Parker. No, you're coming with me, Stefan. You're coming with me. So he's gonna get very unhappy here. Get the camera ready. Where's the camera? There it is. Look! Look, I say. A goblin shark. Oh shit, a hammerhead. Please take my money. Oh shit, I gave all my money to the blue bucks. Gang. Come back. Stefane. Get back here, Stefane. Return. No. No. No, 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 no. I'm afraid that's not how it works, gamer. I'm afraid that's not how it works. He's running! That's not how it works! Look at my shark! Dude, that's disgusting. Can we get some employees over here? He's an old French. Where is he going? 
oh, he, he wants to go see the show and he has a small amount of time to make it. I would drop him in the, the fucking fish tank if it weren't for the fact that, uh, I'm <laughs> pretty sure we need it. Uh, I think we're gonna let the goblin shark live in the reef. I think that's what we're gonna do. I think the goblin shark's gonna live here. Once he's seen the goblin shark... No, blue buck 21. I know, he's sad. He doesn't have family. He wants more family. I think once the goblin shark... Um... dies not dies but when, once he's seen it uh oh uh oh undo undo uh oh how much did i just undo nothing it seems okay don't Wait, did it delete everything about the reef? That sucks. Alright, turn it back into a reef. This doesn't look anything. Why is it so dark? <laughs> Game on, gamer. Why is it so dark compared to everything else? Dude, the blue bucks are dropping like flies. Give, my, give me my terraforming bag. Oh, shit. That's not what I wanted. I don't want a smooth terrain. That's what I want. I want you to go down. I want you to match with all of this. I thought it said Muskox7 wants to replace someone. And I was like, what the fuck? Is that levitating? Please tell me it's levitating. Damn it. The show quality really went to shit after Peter's death, just like Death Note. Stefan Valane just couldn't carry uh, the, the show as the new hero villain. Uh, also, by the way, what the fuck? Pirate Parker dies in Death Note. Spoilers. Look at this ground slowly move like a deflating banana bread. In the depths of the cave lies the treasure. Dude, can I not look down there? What the fuck? In the depths. Giant Warthog 5 wants to reproduce. I've got some bad news, buddy. Also, we're about to go into debt. Hold tight, boys! Ah. At least it was only like 500 in debt. This truly is like Death Note. I just made offhand comment, but it really similar. How is Zoo Tycoon 2 Ultimate Collection the experience anything like Death Note? I've never seen Death Note, but if it's if it's this, boy, am I missing out. Man, they really want to come see Goblin Shark, huh? Holy shit. How much money has this made? Dude, like nothing. <laughs> That's not true. It's made some money. I feel like I should get an educator and just be like, hey, come donate more money. Five hundred dollars. Dude, they really love Goblin Shark. Dude, everyone really loves Goblin Shark. People love a new animal in the zoo.
But where is Stefane Belaine? Oh, is he going? Is he is he uh, viewing the show? That's that's what matters here. Is Stefane Belaine? So I'm kind of spot on with Bray Wyatt's new gimmick. Listen, I spend a majority of my free time dealing with spooky shit that has hidden meanings. And I'm not saying I'm smart, but I'm saying I am pretty solid at telling when there's a double meaning, even if I'm not the best at figuring it out. But I'm pretty amazed at how many people are like, oh, he's just a friendly Mr. Rogers guy now. That's a weird gimmick. It's not that subtle that there's something else going on, right? Like, I thought that was Mark Hamill. You have these moments when you predicted the future. When did I predict the future? I'm just, I was just summarizing the way his gimmick looked, unless you're talking about something else. Bring me Stefan Belaine. There they are. I can't wait to see some animals. But which animals are you going to view, Stefan? Can you move a bit faster towards the location I want you to get to to go view the goblin shark? Hmm. Hmm. It's fucking half subtle, half obvious he's still insane. It's full obvious he's still insane. The only thing that's not obvious is whether or not he's like, he knows he's insane, right? Like, is he faking it? Or, I love how this, this conversation is going to make no sense to anyone who doesn't watch WWE in April of 2019, but for the sake of the live studio audience, it's it's like, is he faking it to try and come off as less of a threat, or is he a genuinely good, eye, a good guy who's just also still kind of insane and spooky? Which I guess that decides, is Bray Wyatt going to be a face or a heel? Because if he's a heel, then he's faking it. If he's a face, then he just happens to also be crazy. I can give you some more places to rest. That's that's extremely doable. I can give them to you here. Don't really want to give you a jungle bench. I'll give you an endangered species bench for litter. Oh, I already have. I have another one. Dude, he's going. Stefan Belaine is going to the goblin shark, and I'm ready. There are still subtle clues throughout the video, but he's clearly still insane. When I mean subtle clue, I mean such like the buzzard uh, means and he listens with the hurt hand. Yes. Hurt and heal. I'm not saying I know everything that's going on like I'm some kind of fucking d deep web analysis YouTube channel. But I'm like, oh, cool, they're doing something with this. There's like a double meaning. So basically what I'm saying is, if everyone on Twitter cries and complains that the Firefly Funhouse is stupid, and they take it away because everyone thinks it's dumb, I'm gonna go fucking feral. Because no one wants to, like, give it a chance. Although it seems like people going crazy on Twitter about it has died down a bit, so hopefully we'll get a chance for this to play out. Or I'm thinking way too into it, and there's gonna be no build whatsoever. Maybe Bray Wyatt was trying to give it a build on Twitter, and then he's just like, and then Vince McMahon is like, "No, thank you." Yes, that's Stefan Belaine. Does anyone remember how I check the photos for the mission? Because I don't. Was it right click? We did it. We did it, boys. Buzzard's name. Yeah. Mercy the Buzzard. Can't wait for the dark web stream. I used to watch some ordinary gamers do the dark web browsings. And they're still interesting, but like just too, far too much of it was just stupid bullshit.
And I get that that's part of the charm, but also, like, I just... just don't want to fucking sit through that much stupid bullshit all the time. I'm gonna give them some picnic tables here to help make them feel better. No! Oh! Excuse me, sorry. I burped when I panicked. I'm trying to give people more places to rest. They have a gazebo. They don't need one there. Um, that place seems good. Yeah, I mean, honestly, we we could we could stand for a couple places to. No one's coming over here, but you know, if you do, come on down. When I first saw it, I thought it was a car crash, but you couldn't look away in a good way. If that makes sense, I mean, it does. I just disagree. But to each their own. I'm not saying you have to like Firefly Funhouse. I'm just saying people better not be like, oh, it's it's too stupid for WWE. Yeah, we wouldn't have had The Undertaker if everything was too stupid for WWE. I ain't saying this is The Undertaker. But I am saying it could be. Found the bell with rattle. I thought that said something about winning a raffle, and I was like, "Oh yeah, baby." I'm just doing this to kill time because we still don't have enough money for bills right now. Um, and also we need fifteen thousand for the hammerhead shark. I think the dino niches or whatever. This is just a carrot. the dino niches is like the alligator and I kind of just want to make the alligator live in the, the reef or something I don't know man cool nice if I could find like some buried gold or something out here that'd be great what do you think hogfist has buried in his cage because hogfist had like a thing I didn't know giant tortoise was sick I don't know good thing they're they're better now Take your predictions now. We're going to go to Hogfist's cage. What what did Hogfist leave after he died? I fucking loved it, but I first thought this was going to be the real death of Bray Wyatt as a character, but I'm wrong. That's what I'm saying. It's still Bray Wyatt. Bray Wyatt, and I didn't talk about this, but the Robert Roode thing, I think, is a very good name change. Not because Robert Roode is better than Bobby Roode, but because they gave reasoning for it. It's... Change is not bad. Change is fine when you explain the change and you have a reason. Both of these changes uh, were given an explanation as to why the change is happening and why that person wants the change and why it's different. Dude, the FPS in walkie mode is so bad. Like, actually, extremely bad. Where am I? Oh, okay, here I am. Let's go investigate the pin of Hogfist. What did he leave behind in his death? What was Hogfist's secret treasure? Eight dollars for the puppet I found. A. Eh? I will say, when everyone was saying that they were going to give Bray Wyatt a puppet master gimmick, I thought he was fucked. But I also thought Aiden English was fucked when they said they were giving him a singer gimmick, but he was fucked irregardless. That's not a word. Regardless of the gimmick. It was just a piece of the war. Hogfist have a full-size turkey in his cave. I mean, he had one twelfth of a... Whatever a war is. So, maybe not too far off. We're gonna have the money for the taxes, but, like... We need the money for the hammerhead shark. Is the thing. Sell the bouquet. Just to get us some more money. I wish I knew where people wanted more places. That's my thing. Is I wish we had just just an easier way. So like the hype around Goblin Shark has died off a bit. 
but it's it's bringing the money up some. Where's my this thing? Extinct Research Lab. Let's just let's just build all the fossils. Let's do that real quick. This is a, this is a, oh my god. This is blinking. What's wrong? This is just the controls. Okay. Well, I didn't really need this, but you were blinking like I did. Okay. Dude, what the fuck? All right, this is going to be tricky actually. No. Okay. We 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 have to use our thinking brain here. This is now a puzzle stream. No, that ain't it. Mm, this could be it. There we go. Alright. Now we're looking for the neck piece. We'll, 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 put, we'll, put a, we'll put a pin in that one. But thinking is hard. I've got this. Don't worry, everyone. I don't think often exclusively so when I need to think like in situations like this I can bring it all together okay, so we need a tiny piece that goes there no I'm glad it auto fills in and I don't have to just like predict what goes where because this would be quite literally impossible for me if I'd actually leave everything in the correct place instead of it just telling me good job you, you figured it out persona has a dynasty warriors game yeah I tweeted about it I mean, I'll probably get it. Especially because apparently all the Persona, or most of the Persona spinoff games are canon, which is news to me. And so I'm just like... By the way, if you see something, like, important pop up on the screen that I miss, please let me know. I'm very focused on this puzzle. So I'll probably look into whatever Persona Q2 is as well. Since I care about Persona 5 and its characters. I'm just mad that I beat the game, and then literally a week later they announce the, the extended version of the game, and I'm just like, eh. That being said, the more I think about it, like, the more I think about how long it's gonna be until the game comes out, uh, the less angry I get, because I'm like, alright, it's gonna be, like, over a year before this shit comes out. I think I'll be fine. I have no idea where this piece is gonna go, and by that I mean right there. This thing looks stupid. I'm seriously considering getting a PS4 next year and getting Persona 5 Royale. I mean, it's a, it's a solid console. I'm just like, oh, hey, it's February, by the way, and we're already, we got a good amount of money, so it's feeling good. Let's make the Dionicus next. We're just making fossils. We're just gaining money making fossils, making sure nothing serious happens. I can't do anything about, uh, you know, needing places to rest because they just won't listen to me. It doesn't matter what I say or what I do. They're just like, no, nah, I actually need more places to rest. All right, nice. We're getting there, we're figuring this out. Hey, that looks good. It's not good. Don't listen to me. That's good though. Uh, so what, I feel like the ask gets added soon. Not this soon though. All right, awesome. Ass, there it is. Chunky leg bone? Not quite. But we're getting there. What? Th I mean, here's a, a thick piece. This, I might. Nope, there it is. Um, that looks like another leg piece, which. I mean, it literally doesn't fit, so I don't know why I keep trying it. Awesome. Um. It's a hilarious arm. Oh god. I wasn't ready for that.
Okay, so this was not the alligator. It's weird. I've always been an Xbox player, but all the game genres I like are on PlayStation. That's just how it is sometimes, you know? Things change. Uh, oh, Doetic Harris, I think, is the alligator thing I'm looking for. What the fuck is this? I'm scared. I didn't know I was playing a horror game suddenly. Happy Halloween, everyone. My musk oxes are dropping like flies. Nice. I'm trying to figure out where the spine goes. Nowhere here yet. Well, I mean, there's a there's a big boy piece right there. Hmm. Look at that. And then, I mean, this one was pretty easy actually. This is a giant rat. What's our news looking like? Nothing too bad. People growing up. Jam those bones in, clap, clap. Oh, that's too hard for my brain. What's what's too hard for your brain? Let's do Doetacaris last, because I think it's the one I actually want. And we're trying to kill some time here. Look how... Oh, I thought these were claws. I was like, look how big this thing's claws are. But this is the back. Where's the head? Excuse me? Does it not... This isn't the head. It's not. Okay, this is like a foot or something. Where is its head at? Oh, this is the head. I don't know what I thought this was. Any predictions for the next hero villain for next season at Zoo Tycoon 2, The Revenger? Dude, I don't know, but they're better... They, they, like, they've got to be better than Stefan Belaine, or this show's going under. Expert Fossil Builder. We're getting there. Like, this, this, this series ain't getting to its Infinity War equivalent if we don't get a better villain. Giant, the Giant Warthogs are dead, I think. I think we might have one left. But we're, we're in touch-and-go area for Giant Warthogs. Because, like, the only way they're getting brought back is if I get their fossils. And even then, if they're all dead by the time I get the fossils, I probably won't bother. Because, like, why would I? I'll just put something else in there that's new and interesting and people care about. But if that last one can stay alive long enough, uh, I'm willing to revive them once I get the fossils. Hmm. I, think, I mean, here's the head, obviously. What is a quagga? I have to ask this question on a regular basis, it seems. Hmm. Hmm. Sorry, what is the issue here? Okay. Is this a little pinchy hand? I refuse to believe it. I'm having some issues here. Hold up. do believe I might be stupid. Alright, what piece has to go here? That's We have to do this slowly. It's, it's you, isn't it? Yeah, okay. Okay. Yeah, I don't think I would have... That, that, that was a little trickier than I was expecting. Also, there's a gap there, which seems a little unfair. I mean... Oh, dude, it's time. I guess it's not time because we have to build the arena or the, the little thing for it. Or do we? Let's go see real quick. What is this? Is this the thing that I want? The Doetacurus or whatever? Oh, God, this is it. Ricky business is cool and all, but we need to see his inner demon, the tax man, come back to save the show. Well, Ricky business is is the tax man. It's not like he's gone. He's never gone. 
He's just kind of like a constant. He's 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 the Joker to our Batman. He may not be the focus, but no one's ever really gone. Is this an alligator armadillo? Is this what I'm looking at here? Is that the head? I don't know what's happening. Does it have a Devil Joe tail? What is this? What is this? I need one of those. <coughs> Peter gone. It's Pirate Parker. He was never Peter. I guess we don't have the alligator. Unless that's the alligator. I need to see what this thing is. I mean, everything's looking fine. Where do we want to build... Is the giant warthog dead? I almost just want to put the hammerhead shark there. No! I didn't know I had a time limit. Pirate Parker was here for a year. I'm pissed. I'm fucking livid. The giant warthogs are dead. They're all gone. Every one of them. Well. Time to start anew. I'm starting over, boys. That bastard. We had to cut Stefan Belaine. He was, uh... He was making the show too shitty. We had to remove him. He got he got he got fired. He was written out of the story. He's not relevant. I have to make this thing. I don't know how difficult this is gonna be. Well, panda time. Up, down, left, right. Up, down. That's right, left, actually. Click up, left. Click up, left, right. Up, click, left, right. Up, click, left, right. We did it. What is this fucking thing? I love it. It's so good. It's so good. We have to make... Oh, well, we gotta wait. Alright. Wait, does it not need the dinosaur? Oh, no, it can. Okay, I was like, does it not need the dinosaur fence? It can use the dinosaur fence. We're going to put them here, because we already have this. Leaves. Is this? Dude, branches. Water. Water. Some roots. Yeah, man, give them the tar pit. Who cares? Give him a tire. Sure, bruh. I'll give you a scratching post. I swear I've bought the scratching post a hundred times. I guess I probably shouldn't have sold half this stuff, but whatever. You know, I lost a couple hundred. That's it. Is it literally using the exact same stuff? No, okay. It's a different biome. Which means the trees and stuff are different, too. Extinct Research Lab 1 is... Re oh, okay. That's that's something else. I was like, excuse me? Let's give them a little bit of each. I don't think you need big rock. Alright. New challenge. A neighboring zoo is a sick female short-faced bear, and they need your help to nurse it back to health. Their animal has contracted a disease. If you accept this challenge, they will drop off the diseased animal at your zoo's front gate. You can slow or stop the spread of the disease by keeping the diseased animal away from your healthy ones. If you can eradicate the disease from your zoo within two months, you'll receive the animal's male mate free of charge, and you'll receive matching donations for your extinct species during that time. 
An animal infected with the disease will have a cloud of germs around its head. To cure the animal, go to your extinct research lab and select the disease curing tab. Your research team should be able to help you find the cure for the disease. An animal is cured when germs no longer surround it. Okay. All right. Let's do it. You know, the stream title is a lie. Well, we were going to feed people to the reef. Can't wait to watch the new show. Will a cop pretend to be a hitman and offer to kill people's family for a low price? We're going to do it. We're playing doctor now. Okay. Alright. Pause the game. We're going to finish this. I mean, all of this is actually fine. So the next step is to go over here. We're going to make another one of these. No, we're not. We're going to take this one that we have. Actually, we're going to save the game. Like, a part of my brain was like, dude, save your game. And you know what? That's a good idea. This is fucking risky business. This is the real risky business. Alright, game saved. We're gonna take this little lad that we just made. We have 20,000 to do this with. No, give me the animal. And we're just gonna go put him where Hogfist used to be. My mouse just fell apart in my hands. This is a bad sign, gamers. Let me put my mouse back together. I remember reading a veterinary manga called Wild Life. Alright. That's cool. Uh, uncreate the animal. It's free. That is all. Alright. Okay. First things first. Short-faced bear. Where are we going to put it? Because the implication is that if we do everything correctly, we're going to get a male, and it's basically just going to be a part of our zoo. So I think we plan for success here. Where's a good place to put this? Are all of our muskoxes dead? No, we, we have a lot of muskox. Never mind. They ain't, they're, they're the new blue bucks, basically, but without all the money. Is a short-faced bear extinct? Wait, hold up. Hold up. Can we get some info on this thing? Oh, they are extinct. Okay, so they can... Well, I guess... Are... Wait, are these considered extinct? They are. Okay, so short-faced bear can go back here somewhere. Hmm, but where do we want them is the thing. Should have put them there. I didn't realize they were extinct. I think the smart money is to put them back here. So take the. Go back to it. I didn't. I, we accidentally. We didn't accidentally, but I forgot we clicked off of it. Take you. Open your your thing. Uh oh, gamers. What pin do you need? I like the brick wall a lot. So it doesn't need dino fence. In fact, dino fence does not appear to be an... Oh, there it is. But, it, and you know, we don't need it. Guests can see through it even as it keeps them safe from the animals they are observing. This is very expensive. Well, it's not endangered. It's extinct. Is the thing... <laughs> Sturdy fence decorated with attractive mosaics. Hmm. I think we want to give them the old... Sections of window fence with an endangered species theme. I think we should use this. And it'll probably be fine.
and maybe the bears will say, hey gamer, can you give us a bit more room? And I'll have to say, mm, I'm thinking about it. But we'll, 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 we'll test the metal here. All right. Next step, putting your junk down. You're a tundra animal, apparently. Not quite what I expected. But to each their own. This looks very much like it's not enough room. I don't think you need water bears or whatever. What's, what's the size of this comparatively? That's definitely not enough room. Streams pausing non-stop. Is that... I believe that's just on your end. Let me make sure that it is not also on my end. But how do I make sure? It's the one thing about mobile is like viewing it, viewing anything. I'm just going to go in a circle for a minute so I can see if this is lagging up real badly. Okay, yeah, that's just on your end. I was making sure the stream ain't blowing up for me. Alright. So we're gonna, we, we gotta give them a bit more room. Maybe the fence is a bad idea. I fully acknowledge using the fence could be a bad idea. As opposed to, like, any other gate whatsoever. But... We're gonna we're gonna work with what we got here. So more tundra. We are gonna give you the cave. So we're gonna put the put the cave back here. Let you go into it on your own. You don't need the umbrella. Raised sleeping platform. Um, let's see how much money we have in a bit first. Give them the grass. They like grass and stuff. Rocks. We can have like a couple rocks. For the most part, that's pretty unnecessary. What is this? Insects. Give it to them. Fish, give. Meat, give. Bananas, uh, give. Water trough, put there. I guess I could give them an animal carcass, but it seems... Give them the log. They'll really like the log. There's no trees that they need. Toys, right. Yes. Give them giant bone. I'm giving them a lot. I understand this. Give them a tire. Alright. I think the bears should be very happy. I think they've been given quite a lot here. And I am also going to give them the, uh, the sleeping platform. So now we're going to go to paths. Which... I'm going to do tundra path. We're going to go ahead and use the, uh, dirt path. The sand path I was using before. Let people come down here to view my luxurious new bear. We're going to go into debt in February. But you know what? It's all for the sake of happy animals and curing diseases. Repenting for past mistakes. Give me the extinct donation box, please. I desperately need it. Pirate, safari, endangered jungle tundra. Give me the endangered. Put it there. 
All right, cool. I'm back and still pausing. That's on your end as far as I can tell because I checked my the video on my end. Like, I opened up the stream and it was fine by me. Is my audio pausing too or is it just the video? Where is the animal at? Okay. Put you here. Open you up. Unpause game. Biome is not suitable. Excuse me? Wait, what? It's a tundra, though. But it's the tundra, though. Oh, it's because there's, like, random bits of dirt for some reason. Okay, that's weird. It's definitely on my end. It's just the video. It's weird. Okay. Apparently, this thing needs more room. Which is crazy to me. That's a lot of room. It went 30 seconds without pausing. Wow. Uh, fuck, dude. How am I going to do this? Alright. Then we remove all of this. And it's going to be free for like a split second. But not actually because the world is paused. And nope, it's free for like a split second despite the world being paused. Click you. Give me this stuff. And look at that. Look how content that is. And look, we'll even give you a little bit of water over here in the corner. Maybe you want some water. There you go. How nice. <laughs> Feel like we've been on February for a while. Yeah, that's the powers of a time god for you. Alright. Back to what I was doing. Hitting play. It's sick. It's freaking out. We need a sample from an animal. Alright. Okay. I'm closer to finishing the cure. What could have caused this? Sample something else or press H for a new research hint. I'm gonna need the hints, though, is the thing. Your research team is taking a coffee break. Snap coffee. Could caffeine be the cause? What? How would it... How did it get caffeine? Do I have to, like... Go investigate the coffee shop or something? Do I have a coffee shop? I forgot it was called Big Ass Wieners. Fucking Bears Walk is weird. Trey, choose wisely. Potato salad or macaroni salad? I hate both of them. I guess I have to go to the soda store because I don't actually have... Oh, fuck, dude. I have to walk all the way there, don't I? Gather a sample from a coffee stand in your zoo. I don't have one. Wait, I don't have one, though. That's an issue, and I'm out of money. That sucks. That's bullshit. It's like it's walking on its hind legs, but it's not. We literally just have to wait until we get more money because I don't have a coffee stand. There's nothing I can do. I'll put a coffee stand back here. No, wait, we'll put a coffee stand in the extinct area. Just because it's faster. So I think I have to walk all the way to it. You don't have a zoo box? Nope. 
Where is the coffee stand? Reptile house. All right, which one of you is coffee? Shish kebab food stand. Sub foods. Coffee drink stand, all right. What's the, what's the difference here? Oh, I think it's themed to be like an extinct animal place. That's pretty sweet. Let's put one of these here. And now we play the waiting game. <laughs> Zoo over Zoo'er. Will it be Zoo Bucks or Starlag? Starlag sounds like it's the name of the next villain. Duncan Zoo Nuts. Please. Donate money. So that I may place this coffee shop down. Only a thousand more monies. Lord help. Give me what I need. I guess I need 2,000 monies actually because I have to put it down. Starlag the third. What happened to the first two? Where's, where's, where, which, which comic do I have to read to get that lore? Dude, I'm getting fat money. I guess it's from the, the show's ending. I know it's diseased. I'm, I have to build a coffee shop. I like that the implication here is that all coffee shops are diseased because it's like, oh my god. This bear has caffeine. We have to build a coffee shop so that we can test. We can't ask them for their caffeine. We have to build our own coffee shop to test our coffee to find a cure for these other people's bear. What has Starlag done to this bear? Starlag spreading a. He's poisoned the caffeine. No, not Super Giant Camel 3. Starlag, you son of a bitch. I'll get you for this. Please. We did it, boys. We did it, boys. Where's my bear? We gotta go. Quick! I need the Jurassic Chino. Starlag the first was shot into the star. Which star? You're close to finishing the This item is renowned for its medicinal properties. What? This plant has fleshy pointed leaves. Search the desert biome for this plant. What the fuck are you talking about? Ah. Uh, uh. Shit, biomes. Um, bi biomes, though. Desert. Trees. That's not how it works. Plant filter. It's, that's, that's it. That's it, isn't it? No, that's desert grass. I'm looking for desert shit. How do I know which one the desert is? Pausing time again. Starlag the second was shot in the sun. Starlag the third's unrelated to the other two, and parents felt like dicks and named him that. <laughs> desert over deserter. We're looking for the the meat plant. Which one of you has the meat plant? It's just the no, it's a giant barrel sponge, you idiot. You fucking moron. Uh. Dude, none of this looks like the 
fucking meat plant to me. It's not a tree, is it? No, it wouldn't be a tree. Am I some kind of fucking moron? Dude. No, it's the wrong one. Just tell me what it is. The aloe vera. Oh, it's aloe vera? That's not a meaty plant. Also, I could have sorted this by desert. I wish someone would have said something. Aloe vera. We really about to cure this bear with aloe vera, huh? You did it. You found the cure to the disease. We did it. I'm, I'm coming, Mr. Bear. Why can't he reach the bear? I did it easily. No! We did it. We made it just in time. They almost had you down. But we wouldn't let them. It's all better now. It's all better now. I hope he's alive. Dude, they're having issues. They can't get to giant super camel. Are you okay? Sleeping. Alright, we're good. The day is saved. Giant super camel, what's wrong? Dude, my mouse stopped working there. What is it? Giant super camel 3? Super giant camel. Oh, we already have the cure. Never mind. They have the same disease. You've eradicated the disease from you. Your extinct animals have some immunity to the disease now, but keep them healthy and clean to avoid another outbreak. Your new short faced bear and a check. Matching donations you earn for your extinct species are on the way. That's it. Has got a thousand fucking dollars? Send me straight to hell. Well, at least we got another short-faced bear, so that's cool. You know, that's, that's a neat and everything. Kerchow. Let's make a, uh, another one of those things. This thing. Up, down, left, right. Up, down, left, right. Dude, it lagged for a second. Up, down, click, right. Up, down, click, right. Right, down, left, up. No! It's imperfect. Also, it's a female, which I think I already have. Dude, they need so much space. Where's the other one? They're so tiny. Why do they need so much space? Also, it was in the water. Are they both female? Yes. Well, let's give them some more space then. I feel like we could give them a different containment thing, but whatever. I think he took the cure and died. A thousand for fucking curing a deadly disease. No, we got six thousand for curing the disease. The thousand was like a check they wrote us to match our donations for extinct animals. And it just goes to show that they really don't care. Our, our, our zoo guests really just don't care about our uh, extinct animals. They get it. Super Doeticuses or whatever. You need more space. I got it. I figured it out. Grass and dirt. Let's give them some of that. There. Here, have some more water, too. Oh, good. The fucking tree disappeared for some reason. There. 
Well, let's go make a third one since we need a guy. Down, up, left, right. Down, up, left, right. Down, up, left, right. Le right, down, left, down. We did it. It's 100%. And also, it's female. We're going to uncreate this animal, and then we're just going to, like, see you later. Nah, the blue bucks robbing them all. The Wild Animal Coalition has initiated a publicity campaign encouraging prominent zoos around the world to return more animals to the wild. Because your zoo is so famous, the coalition has publicly challenged you to release two giant pandas to the wild within the next two months. If at the end of the two months you've released two giant pandas and your zoo fame is still five stars, your quest will be much happier with your zoo. However, if at the end of the two-month period you fail to release two giant pandas or your fame is below five stars, something bad publicity will cause your zoo fame to fall. No. That's way too difficult. Because I would have to build a pin for giant pandas. Actually, I would just have to buy two giant pandas and release them. But they're $50,000? Oh my god. I don't know if we're going to be getting giant pandas anytime soon, lads. $50,000 for a giant panda. Are we sure we don't want me to do a year six off screen so I'm just gaining money the whole time? <laughs> Fuck you, get the hell out of here. I did, don't worry. There's so much shit going on. There's so much fucking upkeep. Let me make my thing. Let me make him. Hurry. Right now. Oh, I can't. It's full. Okay. I don't even think giant pandas can live in the wild. Dude, I don't know. What did that say? Oh. My tapers are dead. Up, left, down, right. Up, right, left, down. Down, up, left, down. We've done it. Thank God. It only took 800 years. Oh no, it needs more space. Alright, I was waiting for it. Biome is not suitable. Excuse me. What? What's wrong? Nothing. It was just being a crybaby. Dude, short faced bear one is already pregnant. I think he took a little bit of advantage of the, the drugs there, to be honest with you. The fuck? Alright. Is our tapir pin empty? Do we have tapirs left? Excuse me. Hello. Oh. Oh. We have one Tapir left. Hello, Tapir. Hello. Are you alone? I'm sorry. There you go. All right. Marine Animal Challenge. This gentle, slow-moving manatee often rests in shallow waters, which can cause them problems, particularly in areas where people use power boats. Every year, dozens of manatees are killed or seriously injured in collisions with power boats. Marine biologists at Marine Oceanic University rescued a manatee injured by a power boat. That damn Starlag and his army of power boats. The researchers would like your zoo to care for the manatee and then release it into the wild after it fully recovers. If you release the manatee back to the wild within two months, the university will donate a pilot whale to your zoo. I, 
I don't want a pilot whale, but thank you for the offer. <laughs> the fucking Tapirs all ran away from neglect. They died. They just died. <sighs> you know what I think we should do next? Get $60,000 and put this in the reef. <laughs> That's what I think we should do next. What is that? Wait, what happened here? Why, why did that happen? A little weird. Star lag. I think. Hmm. I don't know. I want to get sixty thousand dollars and put the wacky alligator in here. Wait, or is that is that the dino? Dino succus is this thing. We don't have Dino Succus. I want to get the Dino Succus though. Can I get like. Can I search for fossils of the Dino Succus? The Sicilian elephant. That's not really what I want. Traino, please be smart with this. Save money and put a giant panda in the coral. No, I'm going to save money. If we can find fossils to build the dino succus, then we don't have to spend any money on, uh, on putting anything in the coral reef. We can just create a dino succus. What the fuck is a thylacine? A dwarf Sicilian elephant. I'm sorry. My mistake. Is there a way for me to like... More looking. I'm like, is there a... A way to check for stuff here? I guess not. Oh, 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 wait, 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 wait. Oh, oh. Oh, they already found this one. Well, good night, sweet musk ox prince. Do we get like new fossils every month or something? Oh, shit. The fuck's going on down here? The Marine Conservation Consortium is dedicated to increasing marine animal populations worldwide. If you breed three different species of marine animal in two months, they'll pay you a breeding fee as a reward. The amount you receive depends on the species you breed. Deal. I'm basically going to do nothing. That absolutely broke everything. I don't know what a thylacine is, but, uh, oh, it's 127 hours with Trey. Is that how many hours it was? Woo. If I can get a goblin shark, we can, uh. Don't make me regret bringing you into this world, Tapir. This is such a beautiful part of the park. Wow, it's so good to be here. Was that Parker? No. It doesn't matter what you thought you saw. Who was that in the cavern? What cavern? What are you talking about? Oh!
Oh, in the, like, the pit? Where all those fossils were? The, it was an employee. There's an employee down here. It's a paleontologist. That's, that's Johnson. Doing the Lord's work. I ask myself, how can I make a shitload more money? He was right next to you. There's like a big delay for this stream right now. Oh, it's saddening. Yeah. We could have had him. Narwhal 3 wants to reproduce but can't find a mate. I could theoretically fix that. I could also just get another goblin shark. There's so many leatherback sea turtles. There's so many. Here, I'll do it. I'll fix it. Narwhal 3 and Narwhal 4 want to reproduce. How can I get a ton of money? How do I get fat stacks of cash? Dude. It's Big Johnson. Can he get out? I mean, if I can, I'm sure he can. Zoo Tycoon to how to make big money. I just want the alligator in the reef. How to make the perfect zoo in Zoo Tycoon 2. I'm good. How to make a profitable zoo. Making money is extremely hard in Zoo Tycoon 2. see for one you have to pay thousands of dollars for an animal yet receive nothing when you export it technically this is more accurate to how things would work in the real world zoos don't buy our animals but the receiving zoo pays the import cost my biggest tip would be with regards to breeding buy a female animal and when she's ready to breed buy a male don't do any actions allow them to mate and once she is pregnant press undo the male will disappear but you'll have your money back don't think of this as cheating. It's just like a zoo doing AI in real life without actually importing the mail. Alright. Well, clearly Google was a mistake. So we're just gonna... We're just gonna not worry about any of that. All my belugas are dying. <laughs> Step on how to make the perfect zoo one you can't. Why? Why are you all like this? They only need more space when they get stuck in a corner. I don't know, man. I can't get $60,000 to put an alligator in there. Ah, a balloon bouquet. Just what I wanted. Can I build the fucking thylacine or whatever? I can. Now let's build a thylacine. I want to know what that is. No, not Velociraptor 10. This looks like literally every other dinosaur we've come across so far. I'm going to be real with you. This doesn't quite uh, pique my fancy. If I could find a different... Uh, sea creature that would be fun to put in the reef. I'd be like all for it, but They all kind of suck, you know, what we haven't heard from in about a hundred years and I'm suddenly very suspicious We haven't heard from the dodos and That makes me really think either all the dodos have died or they're up to something because they used to never shut up When number one answer tells you to cheat. Yeah. It really dab yabba dabba do be like that sometimes. The dodos have escaped long ago. 
I think I might be fucked on this puzzle. Weren't they the ninjas? No, I thought that was the velociraptors. I could be wrong. Okay, wait, we did something. I don't think I have the brain capacity for this puzzle. Man, what the fuck? We gotta take this slow. We gotta figure this out one step at a time. All right. No, this is the this is the no pile. I know. Even if it looks like, well, obviously that's not gonna be it, idiot. I gotta figure it out one way or another. literally exhausted the no pile what the fuck would go here wait shit um uh This makes Brainy have a boo-boo. I know, this is advanced puzzle. I wasn't ready for this. That really looks like it should work, or something close to it. Oh, that looks so much like it should be it. It would help if I knew what this dinosaur was. I have no idea! figure out what goes here. Alright. We're working outwards now. That ain't it either. There's a leg. Put the leg there. We're, we're getting there. What fucking piece goes here? What could possibly go there that I haven't already tried a hundred times? This looks like there's pieces missing. You've got to be fucking kidding me. We did it. We made a fucking shitty T-Rex knockoff that I don't want. How? I'm in hell. Did we pay our taxes recently? Yeah, it's happy. Wait. Oh, not yet. Uh, happy Cinco de Mayo, everyone. It looks like a big dog. Velociraptor 15 is going to build a nest for her young. There's definitely a dodo here. Is that it? There's one dodo left. And that's it.
Why did it terraform? Unterraform, you fool. We're just going to put the hammerhead shark in here. So a new zoo game got announced called Zoo World. Oh, thank God we can play that instead. Let's get some, uh, some lights. I want to be able to see in here. I want them all to see what they have done. I still don't understand how a water filter in this game works, but clearly it doesn't. Anyway, we're never getting 60,000 for this thing. I want it though. I desperately want it. Are the dodos dead? There's one dodo left. Dodo 25 is the only dodo that remains. Guests love your zoo. Does a goblin shark eat meat? Can I learn about a goblin shark here? Goblin shark is a deep water shark that is rarely seen in the shallow coastal waters or anywhere on the surface of the ocean. Its skin is pinkish white, it is very long, it's a very large shark. Males have been measured at 3.8 meters. It feeds on other bottom dwelling animals, sometimes even crabs, because it stays in deep water, it almost never comes into contact with humans in the wild. Okay. Interesting. And what about the hammerhead shark? Is among 10 related species of hammerhead sharks found throughout tropical and temperate areas, large, flattened extensions of the head give these fish a hydroplane like lift and enable them to make sharp returns on other sharks. The eyes and nostrils, by being spaced in the hammerhead, also give them a great ability to track prey. Great hammerhead, two. Wait, what? The great hammerhead, a large toothed, powerful swimmer more than four meters long, has attacked divers. Two other large species also considered dangerous are the scalloped hammerhead and the smooth hammerhead. Alright, I got you. So the scalloped hammerhead's dangerous, huh? Good to know. You see, there's been a lot of stuff going on lately. That that star lag, he's uh he's been causing a lot of issues. Issues that make me think he has a man on the inside. Now lo and behold, I seem to only have a single dodo left. I wonder what happened to all the other dodos, Dodo 25. I wonder who the rat was. I wonder if maybe we have a mole. Well, let's see if this mole can swim. Doo-doo. Doo-doo-doo-doo-doo-doo. Doo-doo-doo-doo-doo-doo. Do 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 Nothing's happening whatsoever. Really wish the shark would do something. Hmm. Well then. Give me a moment. I'm, I'm looking up something. Is this not something I can do? Is this not... Can I... Can I not, uh...
click on the item you want and move it where you want it. Okay. Ultra fast run, walk faster. Monkey me. What? Babies. I was really hoping uh, there would be cheat codes. What? That's a thing I can get? Alright, I know what I want now. One second. Cheapest fence across. Bulldoze all the gates. Alright, I was I was gonna find a cheat for uh, I was gonna find a money cheat. Just so I could get enough for the alligator, just to put the alligator in here. Uh, but that doesn't appear to be a thing. What? Why not? Where'd the pilot whale go? Why is it in here? Maybe you shouldn't let the pilot whale in there. Uh oh! That's an issue! It's quite literally contained, though. So apparently, here's here's a here's a funny quote unquote cheat I found while I was looking for money cheats. Um, by the way, there is one specific animal that I want. Uh, so I'm gonna wait till I have money to buy a second goblin shark, and we're gonna put a goblin shark in, and then I'm basically gonna re-roll everything. And I know you want the pandas, but we just don't have the money for that. There is no money making here in Zoo Tycoon 2 Electrical Engineering. Uh, but there was an, there's an animal that I didn't realize was in the game, and I know it's going to be stupid expensive, but I really want it. I just, I wish there was a way to make more money. That's all I want. I just want to make money faster. I'm not going to do what I was going to do. The more I thought about it, the more I'm like, eh. Here's what we're going to do. I mean, step one. We're clearing this whole thing out. We're erasing the memories of the dodos. They were never here. We're not gonna put anything here. It's just that's just how it's gonna be. We need we need to make some more money. What's 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 other good money making facilities? A cave painting hall. Holy shit. I don't think money making facilities matter. I think we just need more animals. But all the cool animals are expensive. It's like, yeah, I can make a, a spider house, but, like, what's that going to do? It just costs too much money. It just, everything costs too much money. The thing I was going to re-roll to try and get was a plesiosaur. And I wanted to put a plesiosaur in here. But let's be honest. We'd never be able to. I think the Dodo died. Guess cannot get close enough to view Dodo 25's exhibit. I don't think that's the issue here. I don't know. I feel like we may have reached our peak for what we can do in challenge mode. Because we kind of stopped getting challenges too. No we didn't. We're waiting for three marine animals to breed. Which, I don't believe any of that has happened. It's insane that it's a five-star zoo, but we can still barely get over 30,000. What are you talking about? We're barely getting to 10,000. It's May 28th. We're literally about to lose all of it. 
We are quite literally about to lose all of our money. Like, that's, that's going to happen. I want you to watch the money as it rolls over to May, as it rolls over to June 1st. <laughs> what are all these, uh, these pop-ups I'm getting? Yeah, I got my order delivered. Thank you. Was that an Amazon order? I swear I bought it off eBay. Oh, well. Dodo 25 is sick. It really do be like that. It's too hard to look at. Keep looking at it. Just watch. Just watch that 10,000. Watch what happens to it the moment this date rolls over. None of you are reaching Dodo 25. Don't even try. May 31st. Here we go. One more day and I want you to see what happens to our money here in Zoo Tycoon 2. It's game over, gamers. Ready? You ready for this? This is after we fired one of our paleontologists. It's the worst part of the game. You can never make enough money, but you earned enough to get out of debt. Oh, God. There it is. So, actually, we lost about mm, $8,500 every month. So, like, that's, that's, that's what it is, really. All right. The fun and games are over. The sharks stop being funny. What is, do I have like a, a meat eat? Yeah, we do. Oh, the boss servers don't eat meat. They're useless. Do I have no carnivores? Whatsoever? Man, I really don't have a single fucking carnivore, do I? All right, we'll free the dodo. The hammerhead shark's useless. They can go and deal with that. 8,000. It was over 8,000, but yes. That was the gist of it. Honestly, don't really know how you're supposed to get to 50,000. I, I guess there is a way to min-max the zoo, but it's like... I'm at a point... Well, I guess I guess the way you do it is you barely have any employees because that's where, where we lose most of our money. And then I go and manually do everything myself. Dude, fucking just have a big-ass fucking shark party. Who even gives a shit anymore? Look at that. Look at that. I thought that said Dodo 25 was going to lay an egg and I was going to scream. I just want... I don't know. I feel like we've, we've hit what we can do in the game. Like... Yet... Yeah. How... The dodo never dies. Alright. I think it's time. I think it's time. But is it though? I just want- I wish I could just have like a shitload more money. Let's reroll them all. Season 3, let's fucking go. Season 3 sucks. There's nothing happening. We can't get any money. No matter what we do. 
all the cool animals are fifty to sixty thousand dollars. We lose fucking ten thousand like every month. I can't buy any cool animals. We've peaked. All right, cool. We didn't do the we didn't do the challenge. Awesome. Scallop Hammerhead is not getting more water area. I don't even know why I bought it. I bought it so it would be a, a ferocious meat-eating fish that would stalk the reefs. Just don't even, don't even fucking talk to me. I don't even. I'm. I'm don't even want to hear it. We gotta get. <laughs> it's raging. <laughs> If the game says cheat, we should cheat. There's no cheats in the game. I looked up money cheats. There's no cheat codes as far as I can tell. <laughs> the only bright side was the inspection. Will be the villain. Starlag was the third villain, but he never appeared. He's not happy. There's not enough biome for him. This isn't the right biome for the hippo. <laughs> it's not even doing anything. It's just here. I don't even fucking care anymore. Free entry, baby. Sorry, gamers, you'll have to take the long way around. He's just going to stay there. Oh, he's off. Oh my god! <laughs> he got him. <laughs> Thanos snapped that guy into dust. The phone got him. <laughs> standing. I wonder if we can get away with the highest prices now. We're literally, we had all the highest prices. That's how much money we were making with the highest prices. <laughs> the highest prices. Uh. No, not Hippopot in this one. Don't do that to him. No. Oh, <laughs> we hit five stars. We've been at five. I don't want to let the bards. The bards and the, the blue bucks stay f contained. For their own safety. Oh, the Children's Reader Magazine is having a contest for the best animal photographs of the year. If you can get photos of giant pandas, red pandas, and beavers engaged in... I don't think I have those animals, sorry. <laughs> Trey, no, think about this. I'm gonna leave them be. Where's my hippo at? Where he, oh, right, he was crated. That's rude of you. He's mad. <laughs> We've worked too hard to give up. No. I thought someone exploded. I thought the star was someone exploding. If you're doing this, open the floral, the coral floodgate. You're right. You're right, though. Alright, 
Alright, it's Reef. Why did it just make grass? No, make deep water. I can't. Damn it. It's all reef now. It's all reef now. The tax man will never stop us. Come, my hippo. Be free. Who wants to come out next? We can afford it. We're, we can almost afford it. Dude, we can almost afford it. Let's go, boys. Let's go. Why is an aardvark $10,000? Can't put water over pass. I don't want to set the world on fire. <laughs> no, I don't know who I want to follow. Oh, no! <laughs> How did this one happen? <laughs> did it climb the ladder? How did that happen? Where did my hippo go? Oh, there he is. He's all oh, he's eating some grass. He's having a good day. Look at him. Listen, I wanted to leave the game running off screen to get a ton of money, but everyone said, no, Trey. No, we have to see it all on screen. So here you are. This is what this is what you get to see on screen. This is what you wanted. You said, "No. I don't want you to earn money off screen. We'll do things the slow way." Well, I'm tired of doing it the slow way. I can't get any money. We wouldn't have made money. Yes, we would have. We would have made like 10,000 a month. If I would have just left the game running for an in-game year, we would have made like a hundred and twenty thousand dollars. And that's just how it is. We're gonna end June in the red, and if that doesn't kill us, this thing will. Dodo 25 will. It was him. It's you. It was always your fault. You did all of this. It was always you. <laughs> Never has it. Ten dollars a month and lose ten thousand taxes. No, we would have. Er no, we made like twenty thousand a month or so. And then we lose 10,000 in taxes. We would have had a profit of 10,000 a month. But people didn't want to listen. And now look. Oh, what's... Oh, I think they figured it out. Hmm. That's, uh, that's definitely something. I mean, they figure out how to get out. I gotta give them credit for that. Trey setting the zoo on fire. <laughs> Is this what you want? Oh, Super Camel 2 is waiting to use the bathroom. I want to watch him rampage. I want to see it. No, we can't have... We can't be having $2. How are we making money? That's... Looks like we got another month of this, boys. Since the game decided... Since the game decided we wanted to make 40 bucks and then go into debt. Go ahead, rampage some more. Mm 
sorry, Hammerhead Shark. Was this not good enough for you? Here you go. They're free, so it doesn't matter anymore. There you go, buddy. There you go. The Zulag will never die. Uh-oh, everyone. The show's starting. Better come see it. Oh, one of the pilot whales gave birth. Starlag is not contained. Look at him go. Trey, please save the zoo. Oh, it's far past being saved at this point. It's far past being saved. Where's my hippo at? Do you guys think my hippo went? <laughs> it can be rebuilt, redesigned, re-better. No. Where's my hippo? Bring him to me. Bring me my hippo. No, where's my hippo though? But where's my hippo? Hippo? Hip, hip, hippo? Hippo? He deserved better. He deserved better than what he got. He deserved better than what he got. No one's getting out now. That's it. He didn't deserve to go out like that. It's all over for all of you. Round them up. Who's in here? Betsy Yee. Goodbye. Where's my hammerhead? Get the goblin shark too. It's I'm done. I'm mad. He was innocent. He was brought into this world to bring joy to people. 
and they took him out of it. And every one of you fuckers will pay. All he ever wanted was joy. It was to bring happiness. You couldn't help him, Steenerson! You couldn't help him! Every one of you deserves this. Every one of you. I didn't corrupt anyone. He was pure. He did nothing wrong. He was the only light in this dark world. I may have clicked out of the window. By accident. I just, I just, I just. This is all a dream. This is a dream sequence. This is a dream sequence. It didn't happen. This is a dream. It's a filler arc on canon. <laughs> Hippo didn't die. Hippo made it. He was fine. Right, Dunks. Hippo made it out okay. See, he just, just lived a happy life. Look at that. I just have a weird dream tree. <laughs> you wouldn't believe it. And then he Then he woke up as if everything was as if as if nothing was wrong. He just woke up. I'm actually like not doing any of this though, like I think I'm I think I think we're I think we're good on Zoo Tycoon 2. At least, at least for this, uh, at least this series of it. I, th I think we're, I think we're good. Uh. I mean, Freeform. Might be fun for some shenanigans at some point. But I think... I think that's really the gist of the actual gameplay. I think we're good because it's damn hard to make money without grinding. Literally, like, if, if you look up how to make money in Zoo Tycoon 2, it literally just tells you to leave the game open. Like, that's all there is to it. It's like, buy cheap animals at the start. Do these very specific things. Blah, blah, blah. Maybe we'll play Zoo World whenever it comes out, whatever the fuck Zoo World is. Uh, maybe we'll return to this for like a joke during a Sunday stream or something where we just go into freeform mode and just fucking like put a bunch of carnivores and make them fight. I, I will tell you this. If the hammerhead shark would have eaten the dodo bird, I wouldn't have quit. But the moment I was like, I can't even do the funny joke monster in the reef. I can't even do the funny monster in the reef joke. That's when I was like, alright, there's not even, like, anything to look forward to with this stream anymore. Because we can't get any cool animals. The debt kind of stopped being funny. And I can't get a monster in the reef without getting money, which I can't get, so. I mean, Zoo Tycoon 2 was fun. Uh. I don't know what's going to replace it. Maybe we'll just have Mortal Kombat 11 replace it and then bring Monster Hunter back. Maybe not. We'll, we'll like, vote or something. I'll put a poll up. Because Mortal Kombat 11 is not going to be that long in the first place. So it's like, do you even want to bring Monster Hunter back yet? Or do you just want to wait till Mortal Kombat's done? Also, on the note of Mortal Kombat, do you want to do a Mortal Kombat 11 story mode stream tomorrow? 
Do you want to get Mortal Kombat 11 done even faster so that we can play the actual game? Fine, with MK11. MK11 sticking around either way. It's a matter of, do we want to just hold off on Monster Hunter until Mortal Kombat 11's done, and then, you know, just replace it and then put a different game in this game slot, or just do Mortal Kombat and Monster Hunter for now until Mortal Kombat's over? It's something we can decide. Are we doing Mortal Kombat tomorrow, though? Are we getting story mode done even faster? Yeah, it wasn't wonderful. Didn't wait. Well, I'll, I'll probably make a ball. All right, I'm back. <laughs> it was a dream. You missed the best joke. It was all a dream. Look. Look. None of it happened. None of it ever happened. Trey and me have the weirdest dream. It was all the Dodo's dream. Look at that. Wow. It sure does take a long time to load. Look, everything's fine. Nothing bad happened. Everyone's alive. Everyone's happy. The world is a beautiful place. All these wonderful people. All these young lads. Fine with Mario Kombat 11 being tomorrow if you feel like doing it. Mario Kombat 11's fun, and there's always something happening. It was only a dream! Also, I wish this thing wasn't 50,000. Five star Zulag. That's right. I wish I could, like, go into debt buying an animal. Just so I could see some of these goes up. Look, 80,000 for this thing. Ridiculous. Absolutely absurd. Alright, that's it. That's... Hey, thanks for coming to, uh, Zoo Tycoon 2. Thanks for sticking around. Listen, I know some of us are sad that it all had to go up in flames at the end, but I want you to look deep down in your heart. Did you really expect this series to end any other way than the zoo going up in flames? Like, maybe you didn't expect it to happen yet, but did you really think that wouldn't be how it ended? Like, 80,000 is an insane number. It really, really is. So, I, I mean, like, on the one hand, it feels like halfway through year five. We're, like, we're three months into year five. I have, we were a bit farther when I broke down the first time. It's like, yeah, maybe this was a bit early to, like, destroy the whole zoo and end the series. I thought the zoo log would be the first outer space zoo. It's like, yeah. It feels like it's early because we only got halfway through year five. But really, we got like over 12 hours out of this. That's like a David Cage game. And it had a better plot than most David Cage games. So like, you know, I'd, I'd say pretty decent experience all around. Again, we, we, there's a chance we'll come back to it for, like, free-form mode to make shit fight for no reason. I got, finally got the Komodo Dragon I wanted. I'm sorry I couldn't get you the panda you wanted. It's just too expensive. Actually, you know what? You know what? And I was gonna sell literally everything. I'm gonna go watch some hide-and-seek videos on YouTube. Alright, thanks for coming out. I'll see y'all next time. Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! Did you see that? Did you? Oh my god! We should have started with that! <laughs> That's
that's it. Thanks for coming. <laughs> thanks for thanks for coming out. <laughs> Wait, hold on. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Why well, need to find a big group of people? <laughs> oh my god. It's a dragon. Holy shit. Put him at the entrance. I gotta find a big group of people. I We have to see him do that again. Oh my god. What the fuck happened? <laughs> Did you see it? He just- it just ran up and grabbed a guy and just started shaking him. It was the greatest thing I'd ever seen. I have to see it again. I need it to do it again. It's not going to do it again. He's going. If it if the moment it gets someone else, all I heard is oh my god. No, we got to follow him. This is the this, we have to follow him. Please do it again. Please do it again. Why are they flying into the air? <laughs> the zookeeper pulled out of a bazooka. No, stop it. Leave him be. I have to see him do it again. We have to do it, please. Please, God, do it again. Oh my god, that was so good. I'm selling the lamp post. Because I don't know if you can get by. <laughs> I, you have to go back and view it. I don't think he's going to do it again. When the stream ends, you have to go back and watch what happens after I drop the Komodo dragon down. Unless he does it again here. I really think he might. He's really looking angry. No, he's going to sleep. Alright, thanks thanks for coming out, everyone. I will. Alright, we'll end it on this. This is a nice, wholesome finale here. Thanks for coming to Zoo Tycoon 2. It's been a wild ride. <laughs> I'll see you then.